there, this is Rom Wills coming back at you with yet another video. Once again, it is Sovereign Saturday. Nothing wrong with taking time off. Now, yeah, I know everybody wants to work uh, hard to become a sovereign man. And, you know, it's going to take money, time, working, studying, all of that. And then just even maintaining it. But I'm going to tell you what, you don't want to be a workaholic. Trust me, Rom was a workaholic. Rom was a worry. I'm taking more time off now, you know, especially, you know, having that stroke many months ago. I was like, you know, I needed this time off. I wasn't even mad. Needed some time just to just sleep and everything, which was what I was doing. I'm going to tell you what, yes, you want to work hard, but you want to party too. You want to have some time. And even if you have to schedule time, it, it could be just sitting, sitting back meditating or sitting back listening to some music, something like that. It's like every man should take some time off. Like, yes, you, you still need to put in that 60 hours a week probably or whatever amount of time you got to put in. But also make sure, always, always, I don't care. Even if you just take one day off, just to have some time. I remember this young lady, rest her soul, who um, was real good friends with back in the day. Uh, rest her soul. She, unfortunately, she passed away at a younger age, but uh, she was a seven day of Venice. And, you know, went to church with her a couple times. And one of the things I found was they wouldn't, they wouldn't watch TV. Part of the thing was to go to someone's house and just chill. And it'd be a group of them at a house. And we did that a couple times. She found, trust me, even uh, she's from California and she was, uh, let's just say she was on the East Coast for something. And she found, a, she found a group to hang out with, a church to go to. And I'm gonna tell you what, that was very intelligent because what they were telling me was sometimes you just gotta like put everything to the side and just sit back and just, uh, relax and that's very important like take some time off like take a day off at least no matter how hard you have to work if i mean yeah if you gotta work your hours your long hours or even six days a week okay take the seventh day and rest there's a lot of wisdom in there even if you don't follow the christian path or the path laid out in the uh, old testament look Here's the thing, you want to rest, you want to rest, you want to find something to do. And it could be anything, whatever relaxes you, whatever relaxes you. Uh, the day before I recorded this, went to the beach. Cause you know I record my stuff early, went to the beach. Went to the beach with my family and everything. And you know, it was just relaxing. And there were people out on the beach, a lot of people don't actually get in the water. A lot of people, they'll put on some stuff and then grab a book, sit there and read it. But it's a relaxing environment, you know, or, you know, relaxing for you could be hitting the gym. You know, I know some people, they consider the gym, uh, you know, not just for working out, but like their sanctuary. They get in there, they feel better, you know, taking some yoga classes, whatever the case. Find something, find something that relaxes your mind. Like, even if you're in business, some you don't want to have to think about business 24-7. Something that you can step, you can put your business to the side and you can just step up and you say, look, this is what I'm going to do. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to relax, watch this movie, go to this movie, uh, meditate, whatever, go for a walk. You know, maybe you could do something every day, you know, just have like an hour or two or three that every day, no matter how hard you're working, you're like taking some time off. You don't want to, uh, trust me, take it from a workaholic because I am a worker. I am, look, that's just me. I'm always going to be doing something or, you know, I'm always thinking about my plans of global conquest. I'm doing something all the time. I'm doing something all the time. So it's like, you know, I say, you know, sometimes let me just chill. Let me just watch this movie. Let me forget about everything. Let me, let me watch this series on cable. 
something. You know, let me go for a walk. Let me go to the beach. Trust me, trust me, trust me. Because I'm going to tell you what, a lot of people, when they're getting sick, it's not even so much from any like physical ailment, it's from stress. I remember a couple of doctors said that, say people just have a lot of stress. And it's important to take vacations. It's important just, you know, you ain't thinking too deep. And trust me, Ron's a deep thinker. Take it from me. Take it from Mr. Workaholic. You want to take some time off all the time. And there's nothing wrong with that. Now, here's something that is a problem. Because you get some people, they doing that all the time. They not working. I'm going to tell you what, this might not be the place for them because if you do want to be sovereign, you're going to have to work, but you're going to have to have that balance in there somewhere because you get some people, they, they chilling all the time. They are, they'll see this video and be like, well, now that's what I'm going to do. I'm, I'm just going, you know, smoke my J, chill out, relax. That, uh, that dude, Uncle Rom, said so. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no. First of all, if you're relaxing more than you're working, you probably won't get sovereignty. Now, yes, you're going to have to work for sovereignty. And there's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that. Men need to, men need to stay busy. But, you know, you don't want to push your body so much because after a while, because you, you, when you're working and stuff, your body's stressed and all of that. You can run into some problems there. That's why, indeed, that's why some people, you know, they work real hard, but then maybe they own some type of drug or illegal substance, something. You don't want to even be that. You want to be able just to relax on your own, sit back and chill somewhere and all of that. You want to, and you need that. You need that. Yes, you, you're working towards sovereignty, and that's important. But here's another thing. You get sovereignty, and then what? Even when you're maintaining it, then what? Do you want to work, 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 or do you want to sit back and say, hold up, let me enjoy what my sovereignty has brought me. Let me enjoy this nice place I'm living in. Let me go for a drive in this car. You know, this nice car I'm able to buy because, you know, been very successful. Let me just have a nice fun drive. Let me let me go travel someplace, something. But you got you got to take off this time, and there's nothing wrong with it. Don't feel guilty about it, especially if you're working hard. You want to work hard and you want to play hard too. And when I mean play hard, whatever relaxes you, whatever brings your stress level, your blood pressure down, from everything, that's very important. All right. So anyway, anyway, uh, that's all I have for today. Get some rest, y'all. Seriously, get some rest. Take some time off. There's no, there's no shame in that. There's no shame in that, especially if you're working hard. Like, schedule some time off. If you got a schedule, say, look, I ain't going to do anything. I'm going to turn off my phone, everything. Do all that, please. All right? That's all I have for today. Keep rising to become the sovereign man that you are meant to be. Peace and blessings, everyone.